Hey everyone, welcome to Treasures by Ice Lighting. In this video, I'm gonna cover the remaining customizations for your companion and the missing final body color from my last video. So here's your companion standing on his pedestal. And if this is your first time looking at these options, you need to have this unlocked on your Cypher console, the last option in the first column, otherwise you will not be able to see these changes you can make. So we'll start off with the missing body colour, which I speculated came from the raid. Now it actually turned out it came from the Provis Cache. So if you haven't opened one of these before, check out my other videos on how to do it. It's a chance to drop and this was my, uh, I'm going to say ninth, and it was not even on the character I wanted it on. So at least I know where it comes from and that is it there. So we'll take this quick break to show you that colour on this character. So there is your companion standing on his pedestal and that is that colour that was missing. So that's the standard, that's the colour. So now we can skip on to the components. So the first component is the gold and ruby component. Now this one I actually found inside a prying eye. And like with all the others, they're just a click to uh, use and it will disappear and be available in your options. So next is the silver and beryllium component. So this one actually came from a cipher bound and this one was hiding right next to a flower and you can see it there. So the next two both come from the same chest, so it's a chance to drop from the sand-worn chest. So the first one I got was the copper and cobalt. There you go, you can see that. So obviously you need the sand-worn key, which you get from fragments from killing everybody in this area. So the second one is the platinum and emerald, and this one I picked up on a different day from the sand So off from the components, we're now on to the diamond van braces. So this actually dropped from the sand matriarch. So it's probably going to be a drop from any rare, but this is the one that I collected it from. This is the diamond van braces. Now onto the face decoration. So this, I think it's a guaranteed drop from the patterns hand in. So this is your weekly quest to get the 100% of helping everybody. And there it is there, the face decoration. So now we're on to the final two. They both drop from discarded Automa scraps. So this is the shielded core, and this took me a long time. So the chance to drop on these, it, it's just so, so low. Um, I felt like I was farming them for Ever. So this next one is the upgraded core and this one I got from the discarded Automa over in the Catalyst Gardens. So I wish you loads of luck getting these two because it was a nightmare. So now we get to put it all together and see what all your hard work accomplished. So in the Exiles Hollow, click on your pedestal and you will be able to see all your customization options. So as you can see, I have everything apart from that one color on this character. And you can see all your components and I've set everything to base so you can see. And what I'm doing now is showing you that no matter what you do with your component colors that you've selected, nothing changes on your companion. And I thought this was a bit bizarre until I then realized it isn't anything to do with the base, it's to do with the added extras that you have. So once you add one of your extras, like the diamond band braces, for example, and select the colors above, you will be able to see the colors change. So here are the different things that we collected. So that's the face. Now the shielded core, you can't actually see very clearly with the face covering on. So if you take the face covering off, and then put it on, you'll be able to see the actual difference. It's just a thicker sort of circle spinning around. And that's the upgraded core, which just makes him look a bit creepy if you ask me. So now that I've got all the components on, changing the color actually does something. So there you go, that's all the color options. I hope you found this video helpful. As always, thanks for watching and subscribe to see what else I'm up to.